Guys, this is pretty dope. I actually brought this bucket here and dumped it way a while back. Ugh, it looks like something got in there and died or something. God. So I got my bucket here back. That's dope. So now we can head out to our spot. Whew. Well, I was going to say, and we don't have to smell that shit, but we're still going to be smelling it. Just not. We don't have to worry about it splashing out now. Okay, well. Trying to make sure that my car can make it through this shit. It's actually pretty hard. A rock here. Looks like I can make it all the way down, so I'm just gonna drive down there. This cool little rock spot that my brother found. It's 7.17 a.m., it's like 70 something degrees and climbing. So today, look at this. We got some weird stuff going on here. I have a skirtless jig, bam. Basically just a slip float rig. And then I'm rocking a catfish setup, a pre-rigged catfish setup. We're gonna try these numbers out. A little circle hook on here. We've got 65 pound braid on a medium heavy. So we gotta catch some bait before we can even use that rod. Let's hook up the slip float and let's see if anything's gonna take it. I'm seeing a lot of activity, so I'm sure that we're gonna get a bite on something. I don't really know what. Who knows what we're gonna get on, but we're gonna get on something, guys. I guess I'm gonna rig this up, go get my bag, and then I'll cast out. Got a little snack for you guys to smack. Got whatever that is. All right, we got some bait, guys. And guess what I didn't bring? My normal freaking bait knife. Sweet, so we caught some bait finally. Sorry for the sun here, guys. But bam, we got some bait. Let's go ahead and get this junk situated, though. He ain't gonna like this one bit. So what I'm gonna do here, is I'm just gonna grab him by the head, set him down, and huh. Let's go ahead and rig this up. It's nice and nasty. Bluegill are so freaking sticky. Got a freaking blue go head. I'm gonna hopefully get somewhere and wash my hands without getting bit. Okay, well, if anything, we've at least caught a bluegill today, right? You know what, I don't even know if I grabbed my bells. I did, sweet, okay. Got one. A fat bluegill. This hook's a pretty good hook for, for bluegill, too. Take this down here and flip this around, see if we can catch a bass, that'd be cool. So I brought this rod, it's a medium heavy, with, I believe, I wanna say 15, but it may be like 12 pound mono. So far, I just wanna do a quick update, guys. So far, it's been really cool. First ever bow fan, dude, that's nuts. On a square bill that I found on the ground. Wow, look at those teeth marks, guys. What the hell? Are you kidding me? Bass, yes! Sick. So we've caught both in today. We've caught bass. On the square bill, dude, what? I'll never catch fish on a square bill. So this is my first square bill bass this year. That's awesome. Let's see if we can get a better release on it than we did that freaking bow fin here. Y'all ready for this release? Oh, wow. No, he was just swimming weird. What? Out of Kentucky. Last time I pulled out of Kentucky, mother effer almost hooked. I don't know if you can make it out. Probably not, because it's really hard to see, but dude, this thing has some serious teeth. Let's get that smooth. Okay. Look at that, guys. Honestly, for a gar, this dude didn't fight much. See how he's doing right now? That's exactly how I reeled him in. 
until he got closer to the top and then he started making a little bit of a ruckus but all right now to try to i need some really long freaking pliers guys just for this for gar and freaking both in now apparently oh man i don't like gar they move too much fish already guys what from way downtown looks like a bass he's running this way too yep is it another kentucky looks like a large mouth whoop what is going on with this square bill though? I think we can do it. Nope, they always flip off. <laughs> what was I saying? Panfish, bass, bowfin, gar. That was cool. As soon as I started taking it under, I actually rolled that right by that school of fry. Oh man, folks. Remember earlier how I said I wanted to catch one catfish before we leave? It might be happening right now. I didn't hear this jingle. But it's definitely got some slack. I can't tell if it's moving either, but we're about to see if anything's on. Oh, it took us into some junk. Damn it. Oh, it ran me right under that log, dude. There went that. Might have just lost the catfish I was trying to catch today, guys. All good, we gotta head back. Hey, I'm gonna load my crap up and head back to the house. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Jam the man out. My real name is Texan. <laughs> in Japan. I just bust my ass 100 I am jammed.